great result, Neil. Yeah, fantastic, fantastic result and um, performance as well today, which is good. You know, we asked for a, a result. Obviously, we want to get through. Stafford haven't got through first qualifier for a few years, so it's been nice to uh, nice to get through and, and um, edge closer to the first round. Um, but just wanted a reaction really from the lads to, to, to leak the leak performance and the leak result, which we've obviously got today. We've, we've won, and I think we played really well. You knew it was never going to be easy. I mean, they're, you know, they're not a bad side. They're a hard-working side, Walsall Wood. But two goals in the first half, and the second one seemed to settle us down. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Swanee's got a good side here, and they've done a lot of work with the pitch, and he's brought some good players to the football club, and they, they got promoted at the, the, the West Midlands Premier into the Alliance, and they're doing all right in the Alliance. This was always going to be tough for us, and if we didn't approach the game correctly, you know, that we could have been on the end of a defeat here. But um, I'm really pleased, really, really pleased. We did some work Thursday um, for a couple of hours on the pitch, on shape and on pattern play, stuff that has let us down, in my opinion, in um, three out of the four first league games. And we've got lucky a little bit in the first three games, especially two of them where we, you know, we didn't play particularly well but got results. The league game, obviously, didn't play well at all and, and got what we deserved, nothing. But the stuff that we worked on on Thursday, um, fair play to the lads, they've took into today's game and we had a little bit of information on, on Warsaw Wood and what they're about and I, I can't fault any of my lads today, what they've done is they've taken what we did Thursday into the game and that's won us a football match. Um, yes, second goal was superb, settled us down, obviously the first was a decent goal but I thought the second goal was the build-up play, I mean we've had it, shooters had, uh, um, smudgers had the ball off shooter and we're building the play up from our own half which is fantastic something we didn't do at Leek and um, the, move, the moves only five passes in the balls and that was really pleased with that and that set the tone There was a lot of that today in terms of building from the back and we seem to yeah. be more comfortable with that and I thought you know, particularly in the, the centre of the park yeah. you know, Chris Smith and Christian Dakers were everywhere Yeah well that's what we wanted to do you know, you know a couple of little murmurs that were, were just lumping it we're not lumping it what we're trying to do is trying to put the ball into good areas and, and ask questions of def defences quickly and play on the front foot and get our, get our forwards away and cause teams problems and that, sometimes that will mean um, playing for territory you know putting the ball into good areas winning free kicks winning corners winning throw-ins but when we've got the opportunity to play we've got some real good footballers in this squad you know Smudger and Dakes were excellent today but especially Smudger you know he's, he's a footballer and you want him on the ball and, and, and I thought we, have, we, have, we didn't do that at Leek and, and what we worked on on Thursday fair play they took it into today and some of the football was excellent you know, could, have, could have been five or six really with the chance in the second half it could, I mean, and again, a clean sheet, important, and I'll yeah. eat the woodwork twice, yeah. uh, you know, two decent efforts as well, yeah. but, you know, clean sheets are probably as important and probably as, as pleasing for you as the goals at the other end. Definitely, aren't they? you know what I'm like about clean sheets and goals, goals against, it's important to get back to basics and, and make sure we don't concede, um, and we, we look strong today, they didn't really cause us any problems, I mean, that one, you know, if got the, the shot that hits the bar goes in, makes it 2-1, it perhaps could have been a different game, they could have raised their game a little bit, but... I thought game management wise, I thought the lads closed the game out tremendously well. We've got a league game now Tuesday, which yeah. was a bit of a surprise to all of us, yeah. I think, when we were talking last week, but I think that's what you want now. Well, you take, go, go into that. I take that all day, you know, having a Tuesday night game now, because I've just said to the boys, now you've done well, you, you, like I say, you've taken some of that, that training that we've done on Thursday into today's game. Now, can you go again on Tuesday night against Market Drayton, which is going to be really, really tough because local rivals, um, local derby, and obviously Daz is there as well, so we'll have them fired up. So it's 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 whether they can go and do it again now. We're going to we're learning about these boys all, all the time. It's a new squad, and some of these younger boys now have done really well today. Can they go and do it again Tuesday? And I've just said to them, nobody else is playing Tuesday. We're Tuesday, we're top of the league. Through to the next round of the cup, top of the league. What a fantastic start to the season. Let's see if they can do it. Cheers, Neil. No Let's problem. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.